Um, I'm just going to look at my work description. It's Helen Aberdeen. Okay, thank you. Can you confirm your address for me, please? Yeah, one school hill road. That's lovely, thank you. And that's a repeat prescription for your inhalers. Yeah. Excellent. Just ask you to sign in the box for me, please. I wondered if you had a few minutes to chat about a new service which is available to patients like yourself with long-term medications. Um, it's called the chronic medication service. Have you heard about it? No. no? Okay. So basically what we would like to do uh, with your consent is to build you a care record in the pharmacy um, which holds your details of your medication and your health similar to what your GP, your dentist, your nurse already has on file for you. Okay. Um, does that sound like something you'd be happy for us to do? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So basically the idea of the service is to provide patients with the highest level of pharmaceutical care. Your care's already great. Ah, oh, well I'm really pleased to hear that. Um, the idea um, behind this new service is that you're getting the absolute best out of your medicine. Okay. Um, it might not change the way that you get your prescriptions for now, but in the future the GP may issue you with a prescription for 6 or 12 months which we would hold for you in the pharmacy and we would dispense just as normal. So it just means that we can share your information with your consent. Is that something that you'd be happy for us to do for you? Yeah, sure. Yeah, I mean if you have a few minutes just now I'm happy to take you through to the yep. consultation room. Yeah, Great, sure. excellent. Hey Helen, come through. Right, Helen, thanks for coming in. Um, so, as I mentioned before, we do need your consent to build you a care record to hold in the pharmacy. So, if you wouldn't mind just having a read through the, the registration form and if you would be happy to sign in the box and then we can proceed with the consultation. Okay, okay great, thank you. So are you happy for me to take a few notes as we go along? I just want to have a chat about your medicines, your general health, and we can just get everything updated for you today. Okay, yeah. Excellent, thanks. So starting with your repeat prescription. You're currently using two inhaler types. You've got your Clenol for your steroid inhaler and your Ventolin for your reliever. Are you happy with how you're using your inhalers? Yes, yeah. Okay, and you know when to use them and which one to use? Yep, just using the brown one once a day and then the, the blue one when I get wheezy, which isn't very often these days. Great, okay, and you feel like your asthma is quite well controlled? Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Excellent, okay. And your general health, um, you're not allergic to anything that you know of? Not as far as I'm aware. No. Nope. And do you take any other medicines at all from the doctor? No. And do you buy anything over the counter? Just paracetamol and things like that. Okay, yeah. no problem at all. And as far as you're aware, are you having any problems using the inhalers? Um, have you had any cases of oral thrush or um, increased wheeziness or anything lately? No, no, nothing at all. Oh Excellent. And do you go and see the nurse quite regularly for an asthma check? I have not. No, you haven't. No. Okay. Do you remember when you were last in to see her? Oh, yes. <laughs> okay, okay. So that's maybe something that we'll, we'll highlight to the, the doctor. Okay. Um, and we'll just make sure that you're going in for your regular asthma checks. Okay. Usually um, it's just once a year, but, but we'll check when you last were seen um, and we'll make sure that you get an appointment. Very good. Okay, brilliant. Um, so I'm happy that you know you're you're well controlled. You're happy how you're using your your medication. Um, so what I'd like to do now is obviously update and save all the information that I have on file for you. Um, now the next time you'll hear from us is probably when your GP, if or when your GP decides that he would like to issue you with a serial prescription. Okay. So like I said before, a serial prescription will be issued for six or twelve months. We hold that for you in the pharmacy um, and we'll notify you if that happens, okay? So you won't have to order your repeat prescriptions from the surgery as you normally have been doing. You would just come in to us. Um, that's normally monthly or two monthly. And we can just do a check-in with you, make sure everything's up to date, you're happy with everything, um, you're getting the best out of your medicines, and then we can uh, send that information back to your GP. Okay. All right, does that sound okay? Sounds great. Yep. Excellent, perfect. Thank, Thank you for you. coming in. Thank you. Have a nice day.